Okay, so we just figured out the percentage of carbon in carbon dioxide. Um, now let's figure out the percentage of oxygen. Well, we can do this uh, two ways. We can do um, the easy way because we know the percentage of carbon. And we know that carbon dioxide is only composed of carbon and oxygen. And we know the whole of anything has to be 100%. So the percentage of oxygen, the, the, the mass percent, that was the mass percent of carbon, the mass percent of oxygen right, is going to be 100, 0, 0, 0 percent, whatever, minus 27.292 percent. You would expect that it would be the higher value, both because oxygen's heavier and there's more of them, so. And that's going to give you the answer of 72.708 percent oxygen and carbon dioxide. Okay, so you could have done it that way, but say you didn't have this calculation uh, done, or you hadn't done this one in a previous problem. So, let's just erase this. We'll say we Calculated all that other stuff though, so I don't have to recalculate it. And we already wrote the formula. So the mass of oxygen and carbon dioxide. So hopefully we get a number that's very similar to 72.7%. Anyways, um, so in order to do this, you've got to remember that there's two oxygen in carbon dioxide. So you don't just want to put the mass of one oxygen here. This is the mass of all the oxygen in carbon dioxide. So in order to do that, we're going to have to take 15.9994 multiplied by 2. Why? Because there's two of them. So we get 31.9994 a a a divided by sorry forty four point oh one oh a m u okay and then a m u will cancel multiply that by a hundred percent and your units will be a percentage. And we'll see what we get. So 31.9988. And I got 72.70835. So two different ways. Um, do it one of the ways to get the right answer.